In Plessy v. Ferguson, Homer Plessy challenged Louisiana's segregation laws, asserting they violated his 13th and 14th Amendment rights. The state district court, led by Judge Ferguson and the Louisiana Supreme Court, upheld the state's right to enforce segregation in rail cars, drawing on precedents from other states. Plessy took his fight to the U.S. Supreme Court, with his lawyers arguing that segregation laws suggested racial inferiority and eroded his constitutional rights. Louisiana, led by Attorney General Milton Joseph Cunningham, defended the law. The case challenged the legality of segregation and tested the limits of the newly established equal protection principles. It set the stage for the landmark 1896 Supreme Court decision that would cement the doctrine of separate but equal for decades. 